hello programmers spidey is back with another video so in this video i'm talking about uh, how you can fetch uh, news from the google using a uh, web scrapping in python program so uh, this program is around 10 to 12 line longer so let's see how you can do this before starting the video i want to tell that thing just subscribe this machine learning hub you will get the videos related machine learning open CV, python uh, deep learning and many more texts and tips so just subscribe the channel and like and share this video so let's see how we can fetch the news using web scrapping so let's get start so something else so, uh, before starting this just you to open your command prompt on an anaconda prompt first install this library pip install bs4 which is a beautiful soap which will allow us to do web scrapping from the web and after there's another library is called pip install lxml which will allow us to do xml modification so this is a connected library to our uh, bs4 so let's start so so uh, just you have to import from bs4 import beautiful soap beautiful soap as okay i am taking as a soup now it's time to import another library from url lib which is inbuilt library a url lob dot request import url open which will allow us to open the url so now we need to define the source means uh, from which uh, site we will get the we will scrape the news so just i am defining site is equal to uh, this is the official site of the news of the google uh, even this site also doing the web scrapping google news also doing the web scrapping so now we are uh, web scraping the data from this google site so now this our site is uh, we mention our site here so now it's time to the, get the data from the site so before i get the data we need to open this site so this url open will allow us to open the site so i'm just defining another variable op is equal to url open then we have to open our site so our our site is open now so after opening our site we need to read the our data from the site so there is a method called op dot read which allow us to read the data from the site now our data is read and store in this rt variable so now we need to close our site as well as so our site is now closed with this op close method now it's time to uh, web scraping so just uh, i am doing a uh, web scraping here so just i am mentioning sp page so just i am giving a random name sp page is equal to soup and in this soup i have to define our uh, site name so our what is our site name our data is stored in uh, this uh, rd our data is read and stored in this rd so we need to define our rd here after that we need to here write xml because always site and news always in xml format so we are defining xml here so now we need to fetch the all the news which is available in this site so news list is equal to uh, there is a one uh, uh, method which is available in this uh, so just we have to define object name so sp underscore page dot find all so now this find all method will find all the news related to this uh, means this xml file so actually this will find all the post which is available on this site and scrap for us so here i have to mention our item this is item tag which is if you know about html then every news and this kind of data store in item so now what we'll do it will uh, just uh, store uh, it will scrap the all the uh, data from that site which uh, which is available in item tag now our all the data store in this news list so now we need to get the news from this news list so we are using for for news is equal to for news in news list so now uh, we are iterating our news list now it's time to print our news okay so just we are using print then news now news this uh, is equal to news dot title dot text 
means uh, this will return as this title you can see in the output this is the title of the our news it will return in a text format so after that print now now next thing is that we have to uh, print this link as well as because if i want to the read full article then i have to click on this this link so just uh, once again i am uh, writing news instead of now title i am mentioning news dot link once again i am fetching this as a text format now uh, once again now i need to publish uh, this date also print now i have to print this date also so news dot publish date then dot text now we are just uh, we we want to separate uh, every news from each other so just we are uh, uh, using one line so i'm using this line into 16 so just into 16 so now let's run this program i hope i will not get any error Okay, so you can see our news is fetched here. You can see every news. So from the 10 June, I got the news. So 10 June, you can see uh, our last updated news is this, uh, which is our published at uh, midnight at two. So now I uh, this is the news of COVID-19, new COVID-19 cases in Maharashtra today. So if you I want to read that news, just I have to click on this. Uh, link a it will redirect me to this uh, news you can see this is the title this is the publishing date and this is the link so this is the simple uh, application of uh, web scraping so how you can do web scraping this is a just basic example so just like and share this video don't forget to subscribe i, I will make more videos related to this so don't forget to uh, subscribe and like and share this video so thanks for the listening me